Hi, I'm John from Hummingbird Networks, and today we're going to be unboxing and reviewing the Meraki MV21 Indoor Security Camera. Like with all Meraki products, it's 100% cloud managed through the Meraki dashboard, which is great for security cameras. Let me explain why. Most security cameras that you install are difficult to set up and maintain and almost always need extra server hardware and storage, such as an NVR. With Meraki Vision security cameras, all those extras are removed from the equation, thus reducing your equipment investment. All the hardware you need is just what's contained inside this box. Stay tuned for part two of this video, where we go over how easy it is to add the camera, serial number, and license key to the dashboard. Let's go open this up and take a look at the MV21. Okay, put that off to the side. Opened up, very easy, no seals to crack, very simple opening. First thing we'll see is the MV21 guide. I'll put that down here. Open the box a little further and you'll see the camera itself. Let's pop that out and kind of take a look at that. So I'll remove the plastic in just a little bit. Um, here's the back which we'll go over in just a second. I'll put that down for just a minute. Um, that's the camera and here is the hardware kit that comes with it. Uh, also included in the hardware kit is the wall mount bracket, which I'll show you in just a second, and the T-bar mounts for, uh, for drop ceilings. And of course, all the screws and little tool right there to do all that. And then here's the actual mounting bracket that the camera mounts. Uh, this would mount to the wall or the ceiling, and then the camera mounts to this here as well, like so. So you just basically take the camera and then you would just mount it on that. And then you see here you have the screw that would hold that in there so it doesn't remove from the mount. And then this little notch right here, they've kind of thought of everything. This little notch comes out. You can see that and that's where your ethernet cable from here would come out of here through this little notch and then into your ceiling or into your wall or however you have it. So I just wanted to point that out as well. Speaking of the, of the bracket, um, you'll see here that this is a mounting template. So if you're going to use it for the T-bar or you're going to use it for your wall, you'll see different mounting options here. Um, so we'll, we'll put that down just for a second. And then the back of this camera, which we'll show you, there's just a Ethernet jack there and then inside which might be difficult to see in the back is uh, you might not even be able to see it is uh, the hard reset button if you do need that so that's that's kind of nice um, uh, this you know there's no minimum amount of cameras to purchase when you when you buy this from Meraki you can buy just one and use the system with just one or you can use it with thousands of 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 cameras it's not uh, it's not limited by any means. Um, so uh, if you want additional mounting options, they are available such as like a mounting arm, an L mount, or a pole mount. So um, you have different mounting options there, which is really nice. So it's got a two year warranty and you do need to purchase a license, which I'll explain shortly. And I have a separate video that explains all the benefits of the Meraki license as well. So here's your MV21. Starting with basic functionality, it features a 5 megapixel image sensor. It can record at a standard 720p resolution, and it has frame rates of 8 frames per second or 15 frames per second. It also includes automatic infrared night vision, and it has visibility ranges of about 100 feet in low light conditions. It uses standard PoE power using about 11 watts, and if you don't have a PoE switch, it could also be used with a PoE power injector at your switch. I want to say that there's no AC adapter option. But these are all pretty common. What sets the Meraki Vision line apart from all the other security cameras available on the market is the onboard 128 gig of memory that stores up to about three weeks of continuous recording of fully encrypted footage directly on each device. This eliminates the expensive network infrastructure and server bandwidth requirements the traditional cameras use. The MV21 typically only uses 50 kilobytes of bandwidth for metadata storage. It has failover protection and will continue to record even without network connectivity. 
One of the coolest features isn't even on the camera. It's behind the camera, so to speak. Through the Meraki dashboard, you will be able to view all of your available streams through any web browser anywhere in the world without any special software or browser plugins. It's the same dashboard you would use for your Meraki firewalls, APs, phones, and even switches. So if you already have Meraki products, it's the same simple interface you're used to. Inside the dashboard, you can customize what you want to monitor and who has access to it with granular controls. For example, if your receptionist may only need to see who's outside the front door, but not inside the product test lab. Drag and drop camera feeds and save layouts. You can view one camera at a time or up to 12 at a time through video walls. Meraki technology has built in motion and change detection, and you can set up to receive alerts through the dashboard when these are triggered. So for example, something gets stolen. The system software can locate when time and change occurred within seconds. No more manually scanning through hours of video to find the thief. There are also export tools that allow footage to be shared with staff or law enforcement. I'd like to point out that this model does not include a pan tilt zoom feature, but I'm confident that this feature will be coming on newer models in the future. Like other stationary cameras, you have to manually set this camera when you're mounting it. But the good news is that you don't need tools to adjust anything. Furthermore, to get the exact placement you want, you could just view the image while you're using your smartphone or tablet to help you set the image area while you're mounting it. Of course, standard with all Meraki products, you need a license for use. With each license, software updates and new features are included and it's automatically pushed out to the cameras. Meraki is constantly coming up with new improvements and new features. The license also includes 24 by 7 technical support, License management for all your products is built into the Meraki dashboard and all your Meraki products will have only one license expiration date, which simplifies network administration. We have an entire video dedicated to Meraki licensing. This camera is truly the only plug and play security camera available. Here are a few common questions we think will come up, so we want to address them. What if I need more than 20 days of storage? Meraki has stated that with software improvements, they expect the length of time to increase over time. Physical memory cannot be upgraded or replaced. Can you back up video? Not at this time. You can retain exported clips for up to 30 days. If the cameras get stolen or damaged, will my footage be lost? Install these out of reach of potential thieves or vandals. That's what I would do. If that's a concern, check out the MV21 camera, which has an IK10 rating for impact resistance. Unlike other systems, there is not a single point of vulnerability as each camera stores its own video. What happens if the camera loses power? It needs power to record. So if power is a concern, please look into a UPS or switches with redundant power supplies. Can the MV21 be used outdoors? No, this is an indoor model. If you need an outdoor camera, please check out the Meraki MV71 outdoor camera. If you have questions or you want to speak with someone about Meraki cameras, please contact Hummingbird Networks and a security camera specialist will be glad to help. If you liked this video and found it helpful, please be sure to like it, subscribe to our channel, and view our other videos.